Welcome back to another video, family. Make sure y'all mash the like button as soon as y'all come in the building. Prominent Colorado, we back at it again with another episode. The depth charts were just released for tonight's game against Stanford, and Travis Hunter will not be starting on offense or defense. Let me run that by y'all again. The depth charts have been released for the game against Stanford, and Travis Hunter won't be starting either way. And as you see right here, on the depth chart for offense, he's third behind Marion Miller and Dawson. And at corner, he's third behind Carter Stoutmeyer and Jaquez Robinson. So I think this is a smart move to not really have Travis Hunter in there the whole game, which Coach Prime kind of alluded to it. They should be good against Stanford and should be able to have a, a breakout game and really do things that, could propel them to win this game easily because some of the deficiencies that Stanford has, Colorado has those players that's going to make those deficiencies stand out a hundred times more because they have athletes. Stanford don't really have a lot of athletes to stop the athletes that Colorado have. So definitely it's going to be a good game for the Colorado Buffaloes. Hopefully it's not close. It shouldn't be close. Who knows though? Because, like I said, the athletic talent on the opposite side for Colorado compared to Stanford is night and day. So, should be a great game for him. And why not give Travis Hunter another week of rest? You know, get him in there a couple plays just to get him loose. But if you don't really need him, there's no need to really play him a lot this game. So, definitely understand what Coach Rahm is doing. Now, if they get in a tight game, you best believe Travis Hunter is going to be out there playing both ways, running his plays. So I think they're just trying, this Coach Prime is trying to see how they start off. If it's struggling and it's not a good look, then you can expect Travis Hunter to be out there on whichever side of the ball needs it the most. So y'all let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section. Make sure y'all like the video, subscribe to the channel.